What's going on guys? Young Ramsey in this bitch. We here to talk about China and their apparent lift on video game consoles now. Some of you dudes may not be as informed as I am about this subject. Then again, I'm usually not informed about fucking anything. That's the trend on this channel. But um, basically, China, if you guys don't know, has banned most video game consoles in most forms and fashions. There's some that are able to get through, at least before the recent unbanning of them all. But... If we go more into detail about this, we're actually at My Nintendo News right now, where these guys have all the facts here, and it's actually some pretty big stuff, because I, I have some Chinese friends as well, too, and they told me that the main reason as to why China usually does keep big restrictions on things is because their, their population is very easy to motivate or to rebel, so they want to make sure that a huge rebellion doesn't happen in China or a civil war or something like that, because there's so many people living over there, and I guess since they're not as informed as to what you know, certain standards are in the world or educated as to what's, you know, like, or how to think for themselves as much. You know, that's, I heard that's one of the reasons. It's a little bit of a controversial reason, but I heard that has something to do with it. So they try to restrict what goes into their land since any little bit of propaganda or something that kind of like is an outcry or something that might even have, like, like that shows them that they're not being treated right and it could potentially erupt into something really ugly. Anyways, but this is involving video games, and of course, because video games are such a mainstream media way of getting messages to people, it's understandable as to why China banned it. Um, it's still unhumane, but I mean, hey, it's understandable, I guess. Um, so let's take a look at exactly what the article is saying here, because there was somewhat of a... Like, it wasn't like game consoles were totally, fully banned. I think some were allowed in some form, but anyways, China completely lifts the video game console ban. So good news for would-be gamers in China as the Wall Street Journal is reporting that the ban placed on video game consoles in the country has been completely lifted. You may remember that the ban was temporarily lifted by the government in January, but the only way console manufacturers could sell consoles was with the government's approval. Let's hope Nintendo gets its foot in the door. And this is a day to be happy, man. These guys finally have access to the same video game titles and consoles as we do. It does make you wonder as to why China decided to loosen their grip on that facet. but. I guess it's a good thing nonetheless. Finally, anybody who is living in Communist China would be able to keep up with um, gaming media the same way anyone else in the world is able to. Um, some places in China aren't included in terms of that communist dictatorship, so I mean, well not, I shouldn't say dictatorship, but I mean, there's some places like um, Hong Kong, for instance, which are somewhat exempt, so they have their own diplomacy and whatnot, but most of China was underneath, like, um, you know, rules like this. but. Video games are now fully allowed. Um, I wonder what the future is going to hold for that massive uh, for that massive place. Um, I'm going to be keeping up with this one because I think it'll be interesting to see maybe the reception or how well they'll do. Um, China is a very poor country in some parts. Other parts are very prestigious and very rich. Most of it's poor though, and I think the I think the rich to poor gap is one of the biggest in the world in China. So. Whatever the case may be, I'm curious to see where this goes. Does this affect you? Although China's banned YouTube, so I mean, we're not. You're, you're, if you're from China or living in China, if you're living in China right now, you're probably not being able to watch this. But um, still, let me know what you guys think about this in the comments. I thought it was an interesting topic, and I want to see your input on it. Um, please feel free to correct me if I got any facts wrong, since I was basically doing off the top of the head. I really want to know what's going on with this whole thing. And um, what do you think is going to happen in the next year or so um, now that China has access to video games for the first time ever? I'll talk to you dudes in the next video. Take care of yourself. Oh, whoops. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> let me get back here. Um, take care of yourselves. And of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.